All right. Good morning. It's Tuesday, June 6. We've just been talking about cool things we can do to treat ourselves a little bit, to keep our spirits up, go out, sit in the sun, work in the garden, phone a friend, pet your dog, play with your little sister or brother, read a book, watch a show, play game. Just some little things that keep us cheerful. Making myself a cold drink is kind of nice. I'll go and I'll mix fruit juice with my, I have one of those soda things that makes fizzy water. I like fizzy water. <laughs> go for a walk. That's a great one. All right. And please turn those screens on. And um, today we are on the second day of our Flex Week. And yesterday, I have to apologize. I forgot to share the Flex Week project. And a bunch of you, I think, are very confused about two things. So this week, you have three things to do. Three big things. Okay, I'm putting this in chat. Number one, math. And that's, on, that's regular math. It's on the program. We're having the regular class. That's easy. Number two, uh, for writing, you're doing one page of our newspaper. And a bunch of you have been coming up with cool ideas for that. And to find that, I'll show you in a minute where you find that project. You can make more than one page, but everybody needs to make a page of the newspaper. And the third thing you need to do is a flex project. Now, we've done a lot of these, so I thought you guys would have that down. But there are ideas for the flex project on um, language arts. And it's our flex mod. So you have to go to modules and it's on the explanation of this week. And you are supposed to send me an email telling me what flex project you're doing. So some of you have been telling me what you're going to write for the newspaper, um, but it's a different thing. OK, so there's two things you're writing for the newspaper and you're doing a flex project. The newspaper is just like every day for about 15, 20 minutes. You don't have to do a huge thing there. Um, so let me share my screen and show you what I mean by that. So if you go to our website, if you look on the calendar, it doesn't work too well because you don't have links to everything. But if you look on the calendar this week, you'll see that yesterday you could have clicked on the explanation of the week and it would have shown you the flex week. And on Friday, it has a place to submit your final project. Your math is on here. Okay, we're on Tuesday. And then your writing isn't really even on here. So that's confusing. So let's go to, um, let's go to the modules. I think that's a little better way to do it. Oops. So click on subjects, click on language arts. Wait for it to open. <laughs> go to modules, click on modules. And you'll see this week comes up. Last flex week of the year, free choice. So here's an explanation of the week. Here's where you submit your final project. And here's your newspaper writing. So first I'm going to take a look at newspaper writing. So this is what we're doing in the afternoon. If you click on that, it says go here to our shared newspaper slideshow. And some of you were there yesterday, some of you weren't. This gives you the assignment and then each page has your name on it. And you have a week to fill that page in with some newspaper stuff. So some of you have been thinking about what you're going to write for the newspaper, but I really need you to go ahead and get started. Here you can see Christian started. So Christian yesterday put in some of his images. Today, Christian, you need to fill that in with a whole bunch of writing, talking about the movie. You can't just say it's the best movie. You need to explain why you think it's a good movie and, and do some writing. So today you need to add writing, but at least you got started, which is great. Um, not too many people got started. Here we go. Mila's got a, a story that she's starting. So today, everybody needs to go on that newspaper. Again, you can find that under newspaper writing and you click it here, okay? And then um, the other, let's see if we can get back to it. Final project, no, go before that one. The explanation of the week. So this is huge. It's got all these links from the whole year of all the project ideas that you can work on. Um, if you're gonna say, Ms. Laws, can I do this or can I do that? Yes, of course you can do it. But you need to be working on something. This isn't a, a week to just take off school and do nothing. Every day you should be working for a, at least an hour or two on this. And you should still be reading and still doing Dreambox, still doing your math. Um, so school is not done. This is a, just a chance to do something else this week. So there's a lot of links here to all sorts of different projects that you can do. 
Um, but you need to send me an email today telling me what you're doing. So some kids are going to work on coding, making a game. Um, last time we had kids make escape rooms. We have a couple of kids making masks. One is doing paper mache, which is really cool. I've got a kid finishing a report um, that she started earlier on history, a, hist a history report. And um, I've got kids doing service projects in their neighborhood. So all sorts of interesting things. You need to plan your project today. Make sure you send me a, a, a link to it. Get the materials or whatever you need. Tomorrow you need to be doing your project doing it on Thursday and planning how you're going to present it. And on Friday, I'm going to go through and ask everybody, what did you work on this week? Um, tell us about it. And maybe you're doing a report on, um, I don't know, an animal, a whale or something interesting like that. If you really have no idea what to do uh, or don't want to do this, you may do the flex um, or the, the online curriculum that we haven't done this year. You'll see in science, there's several projects that we haven't done. One of them is space. So you can see human body, but the next one's solar system, and we're not going to have a chance to get to that. So you could go in and do the solar system unit this week. You could do one assignment every day. Here's day one could be the pretest and, and lesson one, day two, the solar system, day three, sun and stars, day four, characteristics, and day five, inner and outer planets. That would be fine for the week if you don't want to do a flex project. Okay, are there any questions about what we're doing this week? Okay. Do I have kids who want to do their job today who did not do their job yesterday and had a joke or a riddle or a weather report, anything like that? I think it's going to get hot this weekend. I see no hands raised. All right. Then 